Doc, your sense of timing leaves a great deal to be desired. I'm sorry. This will only take a minute. Excuse me. Excuse me. <sighs> Congratulations, Lillian. This is your night. My night? Sure. Everybody knows what happens on a second date with Gopher Smith. <laughs> what happened? What do you think? I mean, scented candles in his cabin, red light bulbs and all the lamps. Oh, I bet he's got those champagne cocktails already made. You sure are lucky. This will be a night you'll never forget. Gail, I think you and I better have a little talk Don't right come now. near me. No, no, no. no. I'm only 14 years old, Gopher Smith, and if you touch me, I'm going to tell my mommy and daddy. And really, I'm not even 14 yet. I'm 13 and three quarters. Wait a minute. You called me Gail. You know? Oh, there they are, Captain. Daddy! Oh, darling. Gail. G Gail, what are you doing all dressed up like that? Just look at your hair and all that makeup. <laughs> I suppose this is your idea, you... No, no, Daddy. You... It's not his fault. I was just dressing up like a grown-up to have some fun. Mr. Gerber, I had no idea. Young lady. I mean, little girl. I think it's time we had a nice, long talk. Well, it was just pretend. Fine. When we get to the cabin, I'm going to give you a pretend spanking. 